We've got some difficult days ahead. But it really doesn't matter with me now. Because I've been to the mountaintop. My name is Letitia Brooks. I graduated from Concordia's theater program in 2012. My name is Tristan DeLala. Uh, I've been a professional actor for about 20 years. Exactly three years ago, uh, in 2014, I saw this show in Toronto. Obsidian and the Shaw Festival did a co-pro of it, and I loved it. Um, exactly three years ago, <laughs> I was in Toronto, uh, and I went to see a production of The Mountain Top with Letitia, actually. I remember at the end of the show, I turned to Tristan, and we were just crying. Bawling and applauding. Um, Letitia turned to me and said, we have to do this. It was just so amazing. And it was so moving and so breathtaking, and it hit every single soul in that audience. I'm so glad I get to finally do it. Pretty much a dream come true. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., for me, is a man ahead of his time. Dr. King is a hero. What he stood for, unfortunately, still applies today. And he was also so brave. I don't think most people would be willing to leave their families and go on the front lines and march for what they really believe in. A lot of times he's reduced to a march and a speech. Um, and that's what people really know of him, or all they really know of him. But so many other things in his life that he's accomplished get get put to the side. He had a wife and a family, and he was just out all the time going after what he believed in. In researching him more for this role, um, I'm reminded of how much he was a hero to me growing up for all these other different reasons. And um, he's just a reminder that no matter where you come from, um, you can have an impact on the world. Tori Hall was brilliant, and I think in watching this, she wants us as an audience to come away knowing that. Martin Luther King was just a man. He was just this human, just like you or I or anybody watching this, this tape. And if someone so ordinary could do such extraordinary things, then imagine what we could do. I think she challenges our notions of what is right, what is wrong. Um, and I think she does it in a really, really magnificent way. Of course, we're not all gonna become leaders of movements, but... No matter what humble beginnings you come from, you can achieve greatness. And even well after you're gone, that greatness can permeate the world. People should come and watch this play because it is so fun. You are going to laugh, you are going to cry, you are going to think and talk about the show after you leave. Because it's going to be lit, because it's dope. Um, I think in seeing this production, people will be really entertained. And they might, hopefully, see themselves in a new light, see Dr. King in a new light. They might challenge themselves on things that they think they believe in. I just want to do God's will. And he has allowed me to go up to the mountain. And I've looked over. And I've seen the promised land. I may not get there with you. But I want you to know the night that we as a people will get to the promised land. So I'm happy tonight. I'm not worried about anything. I'm not fearing any man. Mine eyes have seen the glory of the coming of the Lord.